coming into the game, obviously, North Carolina, they're a great team. Talk about what was kind of the game plan coming into the match. Well, the, the game plan was, was two things. One is uh, to disrupt their play, um, not let them get in a rhythm, not let them get big defensively. And then attacking-wise was get in a uh, transition. Uh, we felt that when they do attack, that we could, uh, uh, when they were open, get at them and get in transition. And we, we created enough opportunities uh, to get one today. So going into the championship game, obviously, you played Notre Dame to the wire. Tate had the game winner there. Wake Forest, you win the overtime at Wake, which obviously Wake is the number one team in the country. And then UNC, you come here and you beat them. Talk about the, the ACC as a whole. Talk about this conference and the path it took to get here. Yeah. The, the regular season uh, in the ACC prepares you for this. And um, the, the tournament, the road that we had in the last week from Sunday to Sunday, uh, it was probably harder uh, to win the ACC tournament than maybe the, you, uh, the NCAA tournament, just because of um, the, the level of teams we played along the way. Of RPI, we played uh, Notre Dame, which is five, and then uh, Wake Forest, which is one, and then today, I think UNC was a three RPI, so in, in a week's time, we played three of the, the top five teams in the country. Coach, looking at that first half, it was a very interesting first half by you guys because you were aggressive, but you were patient when you came in the box. Just kind of talk about how you were able to do that in the first half and have that perfect balance. Yeah, like I said, we, we wanted to get at them in transition, and um, that was important. Uh, but not waste the opportunities. And when it wasn't there, uh, to connect the, the passes and wait for a good opportunity. And um, the one that happened that uh, Isaiah receives it as a second ball instead of him going himself, finds Tate, and then Tate finds Sharif and uh, created a really good opportunity, great goal. All right, Coach, and let's talk about, the, if you don't mind, just walk me through the goal a little bit, how the goal was created and how it was scored. Well, the, the goal started uh, with Cody, our uh, right center back, who um, received a ball, a square ball, and picked his head up, and in that saw both Tate and Keno making runs in behind. Uh, he tried to play them, uh, didn't find them in behind, but in UNC winning the ball, uh, Isaiah ends up t picking up the second ball, and with that, um, finds Tate again. Tate finds Sharif, and Sharif put it away and uh, we're happy for Sharif as well because it's his birthday today so it was a it was a great goal and a great celebration How about the second half obviously maybe a little tell, tell me what you told the team just what the mindset was because obviously you don't want to not score but you want to play a little defense be a little protective right well we, we felt we were going to need a second goal um, and uh, we were prepared in the second half to come out and go after it but also not open ourselves up and uh, I thought we had a good balance of that, that those opportunities we had to go forward, we took them. We probably would have liked to have held the ball a little bit more in the second half, but defensively, I thought we were really sound. Talk about your MVP, Tate. Obviously, you know, he's been a, he's been a huge key to this, to this team all year. And what it means for you to see him get the MVP and, and kind of get what he deserves. Yeah, I'm, I'm proud of Tate for a lot of reasons. One is he's a great example on the field for our guys, uh, his leadership. Um, but most of all, on the field, he's a great model for our guys, especially in big games. He shows up, and um, uh, he's been tremendous for us all season. All right, two more questions for you, Coach. Talk about what it means to win this. Obviously, this is your first one, second time here for sports championship. What it means to you as a program now that you're in the ACC? Well, you know, it's a, it's a culmination um, of a lot of hard work for these guys this season, but our program. Um, our program has continued to grow and um, to be a part of the ACC and um, uh, in, living in a neighborhood with such great schools, uh, not only academically but as a, as a soccer conference, to win it is pretty special because um, if you win in an ACC tournament, um, it, it puts you among the best in the country. And for our program, I'm really happy for our guys uh, right from the beginning of the season of the effort they put into it and uh, the, the, the culmination of, of uh, lifting the trophy. Final question, Coach. Let's talk about the clutchness. You know, this team, it's not like you guys were winning 5 nothing. You beat Notre Dame with that strike from, from uh, Tate's head. You win the second one in OT against Wake, number one team, and then you, you beat UNC with one nothing. We, we told our guys that if we put ourselves in position to win games, we're going to win them. Um, we just feel like uh, we're a team that is prepared to do that. And, 
uh, come the end of the game. We're uh, poised and grown into a team that is uh, finding ways to win.